YouTube. What's up, baby? <laughs> I, I covered up my mouth because I just woke up uh, not too long ago. Uh, my beautiful wife woke me up with her beautiful phone call. Um, but uh, I just, I got up, you know, I got um, 50 minutes. No, 40 minutes before my 10 hour clock is up. And I just thought to ask, what is your morning regimen? Or what, what do you do when your shift starts, right? Do you wake up, like say your 10 hour break is up, do you give, do you wake up 30 minutes before your, uh, your break is up? Do you wake up an hour, hour and a half, two hours? Like, what do you do? Okay. Do you wake up? Do you make your bed in the back? Do you, uh, you know, do you take a shower at the beginning of your 10 hour break? Or do you take a shower at the end of your 10 hour break? You know, like, what do you do? Do you take, do you sleep your whole 10 hour break? And then when your 10 hour break is up, do you wake up and then take a shower and, you know, clean yourself up, you know? So what do you do? Let me know. Me, uh, I just again, why I said I didn't, I didn't brush my teeth yet, okay? I'm sorry, but I had stopped at this rest area, which is like one mile away from the pilot that I'm about to go to to clean myself up, okay? Um, I could just you know get the little water bottle and brush my teeth here, but I'm gonna wait till I get there, <clears throat> get a shower and I can do all that together, okay? So I apologize for talking to y'all with morning breath, okay? I I'm so sorry. Can you scr scratch and sniff? Can you smell it? I hope it don't smell bad. But yeah, you know, do you get up and, uh -oh. do you get up and only with 30 minutes to spare and then you're rushing, you know? I recommend, that you get up at least an hour before, okay, depending on if you need to take a shower, you know, whatever you need to do, okay? Get yourself awake, you know, eat, get yourself prepared, and then go. At least an hour, you know? I don't, it, it kinda will mess you. Oh, shit, I won't even in a parking space. That's not my fault, bro. It's the, the trucks that was here before me was not in a parking space, bro. I, bro, I'm taking up two parking spaces. It was dark, it was late, and I was tired, okay? But the reason I stayed here is because I knew for a fact that there was not gonna be any parking at that small pilot down the street, okay? So I came here, and there was a few spots open, and if there wasn't any spots open here, then I was just gonna have to find my own parking space. You know what I mean? So, but yeah. I recommend that you get up, you know, do some meditation, think about your day, how are you gonna complete it, set a couple of goals, you know, when I do my 30 minute break, I'm gonna eat me a snack and do some business uh, paperwork or do some research on how to expand or grow my business. Um, and you know, and things like that, man. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Cause you can get out here and be real lazy, okay? You can get out here, you're like, man, I'm only gonna wake up with 15 minutes to go, brush my teeth real quick, and then I'm out. But what if you gotta take a number two? You know, are you a morning number twoer? Are you an afternoon morning? You know, are are you regular? Do you go a couple of days without? I hope not. Uh, you know, do you go more than once? You know, so those are things you wanna think about when you come out here, man, because your schedule already is irregular. Okay, so you want to try to stay on a schedule as much as possible because it's going to be tough to do that anyway. So, you know, one of the things that can help you with that is getting up at least an hour in advance before it's time for you to go. Okay, no, I, I like to get up an hour before my 10 hour break is up because when it when that 10 hour break is up, we are moving. Okay, now when I say moving, I'm talking about you know, we're doing a pre trip. And, uh, and things like that, checking over the truck, checking the cargo, and we're planning our day out of what we're gonna do, 
Okay, now I don't do that trip planning crap. I just, what? I guess you could say it's a form of trip planning. But I don't like write it down, write it on my window, and all that other stuff. Again, when you out here, after a year or so, and especially with me being with the same company, you already know the routes. And it's not even knowing the routes from here to there. You know, it's just, I know how to get from Maine to Indiana. You know what I'm saying? I, it was a bunch of ways I could go. You know, I could go 90 and pay a million and five tolls, or I could just go 80. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I'm going to go 80. But, uh, yeah, you want to plan your day out. That will make your day a lot easier. That'll help you prepare for any minor mishaps or obstacles in your day. You know what I'm saying? So, wake up, man. And, and, and be excited and be happy and be thankful for this great opportunity you have sitting here in this seat. You know, one of the secrets of why I'm so happy and why I'm so, uh, 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 uh pro not profitable, uh, so, um, so, uh, uh, I don't know what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm trying to say. I'm sure so I probably said it for me already, okay? But yeah, man, RV, baby. I got to get me one. But uh, yeah, man, just plan out your day. Get up. Don't wait to the last minute. And, you know, if you're not always on social media, watching TV or, you know, playing around on your 10 hour break, you will actually get eight hours. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, go to sleep, wake up, let's get it going. Okay, so if you got, if you're gonna go take a shower, I definitely would recommend, you know, getting up two hours before your 10 hour break, okay? Because you never know what the line is for uh, for the showers. Now, depending on what time you are at the, the truck stop, you know, like right now, it is 11 o'clock where I am. So the line shouldn't be long because most people should be out driving. It's a beautiful day out here. And uh, it's actually really beautiful because the past two days up here in the Northeast, it was raining. Okay, so I'm excited about getting my day started, enjoying this beautiful weather, enjoying a nice drive by myself, listening to music, and you know, just uh, accomplish any goals I set today. Okay, so uh, I just wanted to break, put this out here, put some positive vibe into your, to your life and, and give you a snippet on how I am happy every day in this truck okay so it was just on my mind I'm sorry you know if you ain't about that life man you might want to get out that truck and go brush your teeth you know what I mean